We're here to idea everyone, to fire up your curiosity and connect you with the people and ideas that shape our world. Watch, listen, understand, connect, create. Let's move the human story forward together. Hello and welcome to The Poetry of Science, a podcast which provides insight into new scientific research via the medium of poetry. I'm your host, Dr. Sam Lingworth, and each week I'll be introducing you to some of the latest scientific findings and sharing a selection of science themes poetry. After all, we could all do with a little bit more poetry in our lives. In this episode, I'll be exploring new research, which has found that global flash droughts are expected to increase in a warming climate. In harvests grasp, where seasons dance and futures twirl, a thief in the night takes what months had given through heat and wind and drought. A rapid seer that tears earth's quilt, starving stalks and pulling seeds with weeping hands beneath our blazing, smoke-filled sky. This poem is inspired by recent research published in the journal Communications, Earth and Environment, which has found that flash droughts, quick and severe droughts posing challenges to sectors like agriculture, are predicted to increase with global warming, especially in North America and Europe. A flash drought is a meteorological phenomenon that is characterised by a sudden and rapid onset of drought conditions. Unlike conventional droughts, which develop and intensify over months to years, flash droughts can occur within a matter of days to weeks. This swift transition can be triggered by a combination of factors, including high temperatures, low humidity, strong winds and minimal precipitation, all of which lead to a rapid increase in evapotranspiration, the process by which water is transferred from the land to the atmosphere by evaporation from the soil and other surfaces, and by transpiration from plants. Given their unexpected nature and rapid evolution, flash droughts pose significant challenges to sectors that are dependent on regular and predictable rainfall patterns, particularly agriculture. In this new study, researchers used global climate model simulations to explore the impact that global warming is likely having on the frequency of flash droughts. In analysing these simulations, the researchers found that flash droughts are projected to become increasingly frequent with the progressive warming of our planet, especially under scenarios involving excessive fossil fuel usage. As such, the risk of flash droughts over global croplands is anticipated to rise, with the most significant projected increases expected in North America and Europe. This escalation in risk could potentially disrupt our agricultural productivity with cascading effects on our food supply and economy. However, the study provides a potential solution. If we manage to adhere to lower and medium emission scenarios, as opposed to the high-end ones, we could see a significant reduction in the annual risk of flash drought over croplands. Now that you've heard the science, let me read the poem to you again. In harvests grasp, where seasons dance and futures twirl, a thief in the night takes what months had given through heat and wind and drought. A rapid seer that tears earth's quilt, starving stalks and pulling seeds with weeping hands beneath our blazing, smoke-filled, in this section of the podcast, I'd like to share a poem written by another poet on a topic related to the science that has been discussed so far. In this episode, I'll be reading Dear Drought by Amy Beader. Amy Beader is a versatile writer who has explored diverse realms of humanity. With experience as a former human rights observer in Haiti, as well as a high school teacher in West Africa, Beader combines rhythmic mastery and an ominous touch in her poetry. Her collections, including Burn the Field, published in 2006, Now Make an Altar, published in 2012, and And So Wax Was Made and Also Honey, published in 2020, showcase her reverence for words and delve into the construction of beauty and strangeness. 
Her honours include a 2001 Discovery of the Nation Award, a Breadloaf Scholarship, and an award from the Emerging Writers Network. Dear Drought, by Amy Beder. Offer your usual posy of goat heads. Proffer sharp garlands of thistle and incas thin down, of squash bugs strung on blighted stems. Send back necklace to every reeking pearl I crushed, each egg cluster that I scraped away with knife or twig or thumbnail. Wake me sweet-laced from a dream of hidden stables, the gentle foals a-tremble, stem-legged, long-neglected. Dear drought, our summer's corn was overrun again with weed and cheat, the bitter zinayas fell to bits. Dear yearlings, our harvest is lattice and husk. Thank you for listening to the Poetry of Science. Thank you very much for being with us for this episode of the Idea Me Show. Idea Me is a global platform. Our mission is to move the human story forward by sharing knowledge of the future. You can find us on all major audio networks at www.radioideame.com, on YouTube and Vimeo. Please subscribe.